My name is Daniel. I'm 22. And I have homophobia. I've met a lot of people, you know, that think the way I think is different or weird or something, but to me, I, there's just certain things I, I can't do. I mean, I, I'd like to drive a car, you know? I just don't understand why anyone would drive a car with that. I mean, look at this, man. I mean, look at it. It's a fucking big monster black stick, like... I'm not holding that. What's wrong, bro? I forgot my key card. Alright, well, let's just take the stairs. No. No. What's wrong with the stairs? Because if I go up the stairs and you go behind me, you're looking at my ass, right? Right? I... And if you go up and I go up behind you, then I'm looking at your ass. I can't turn around. What are you gonna do, look at my dick? I'm not taking the stairs, okay? It's not my fault this building doesn't have an elevator, right? I didn't choose to make this building so fucking gay. I don't pick things up when I drop them, you know? If I drop something, it's gone. That's it. I don't know who's gay out there. I've been to who, anyone could look at me and develop a fantasy or some perversion, take that with them, and now I'm someone's fantasy, all because I bent over to what, pick up my wallet? No. My wallet stays there, my dignity stays here. What the fuck is this? Sorry, man. I just I, I dropped it. Could you just could you just grab it for me, dude? I'm not. This is this this is it. Okay. There's a mountain of Cheerios on the floor. Dude, come on. I mean, you always do this. Why are you being weird about it? I know. That's the point. That's the problem. I always pick it up and I look at look at this, dude. I mean, this is just too much. There's a broom right there. But Take that, it. You don't even have to bend over. You can just stand straight up, vertebrae cocked, and just fucking sweep it into a pan, Okay, for, first of all, I'm, I'm not gonna grab anything with a stick on it. I'm not gonna do anything cocked or whatever that thing you just did was right there, dude. What the, why would you even say that to me? Listen, man, you either get some help or you get the fuck out. I think I changed for the better. You know, I'm whole, you know, I'm using spoons again, drinking milk, <laughs> picking up after myself. You know, so I'll say I'm pretty much back to normal. The stairs get hard sometimes, but I push through it. But you know, I'm not going to start telling guys secrets or, you know, doing guys favors. Because I'm not with the gay shit, obviously.